Now, one of the cornerstones of a recovery program is the serenity prayer. So, what I'm going to offer you in this, uh, in this video is just simply tapping to the serenity prayer. So, we're not going to do a setup. We're just going to start tapping on the endpoints. And what I recommend is if you are highly activated, if you've gotten triggered, then you don't want to worry about the setup and either or and all of that junk. All you want to do is tap. And the serenity prayer is a beautiful way to do it. So I'm going to lead you through that and I'm going to show you a variety of ways because you can do the tapping, but you may not be in the privacy of your home, home to do that. So I want to show you another way to do it and then I'll weave this in. And then there's also another little mantra I use that you can say if you don't want to say the whole serenity prayer. So I'm going to guide you through that. But before we get started, I want to show you these other points. If you are someplace where you cannot be this demonstrative about tapping, all you have to do, and this is good even if you're not saying the serenity prayer, or if you're saying it silently. Let's say you're at a meeting and you get triggered, and you can't leave the meeting. You just simply put your hands under the table, and these are the points. It's right here on the two fingers. It's the outside of the thumb, outside of the index finger, middle finger. Some do the ring finger, some don't. I do just because it's easy. It's easier to do it than to skip it. And I think there is something there, but, but you're not going to do any damage doing it. And then the little finger. And again, what I do is I take the index finger, I come around, and I tap like that. And then I tap on each of them with the thumb, like that, round, and I just do that while I'm saying something, okay? Now, I used this one time I was at the dentist, and I had all this stuff in my mouth, and I have gag reflex rule, or I can have it, and, and I had to do something to just keep myself calm, and I had my hands just on that thing that they put on you, you know? And I was just doing it. I did it probably for an hour. I wasn't even saying anything. I was just tapping. It's a very good coping mechanism, you guys, just to take the edge off. It gets you through that next five seconds, which gets you through the next five minutes, which gets you through the next five hours, which gets you through the next 24 hours. That's what my 30 days of Pro EFT is all about. So I encourage you to check that out. For right now, let's just start tapping, and I'm going to recite the... the um, serenity prayer and if you don't know that you will by the time we go through it a couple times then I'm going to shift to my little mantra and at times I'll use my fingers at times I'll use the tapping so just follow me okay God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change the courage to change the things that I can and the wisdom to know the difference. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things that I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things that I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now that gives you an idea. You just recite it and just tap on the places that we've been tapping. And any resistance that you have to, to allowing that prayer to, to infiltrate your belief system, your, your cells, will be neutralized. Because anything that's disturbed when you're saying that, or in, in, uh, not in harmony with that, You'll just be gently untying the knot. So just recite it and tap, recite it and tap. Now, if you can't tap like that, you can just have it, you know, like I was saying before. Now, I don't know if my hands will be picked up by the camera, so I'm going to hold them up, but I usually hold them on my lap. God grant me the serenity 
to accept the things that I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. And he just keeps saying that. Now my abbreviated version of that is, uh, I go something like this, and it's just a little mantra. God's love resolves this situation here and now. 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 And you can put any words to it. You just want something to intervene. And you're using the tapping to neutralize any disturbance that goes with you allowing that to be so. So I hope that's been helpful. Just pull that out and use that anytime you're stressed to get through the next five seconds, five minutes, five hours, 24 hours.